We are. Yeah, we are, because I'm bringing you with me. I am headed over to um, my friend and student Laura's house, and we are going to do some more art tutoring, coaching kind of stuff. I don't know what to call it exactly that we do. Anyway, I'm going to be over there for a couple hours, and it is finally raining outside. We need the rain in California, but I am worried about all my friends and loved ones who are in, were in or near the fire areas um, that we've had recently because now there's no vegetation to stop landslides so anyway but we're getting water I may go run an errand after I'm done with Laura I may not I may decide to just come home because the weather is kind of on the icky side um, we'll see I do have a flannel shirt on today because I'm just I'm not cold exactly, but you know, it's just a flannel shirt kind of day. I have flannel shirts on, shirt on with a tank top underneath it, my stretchy pants and tennis shoes, because you know that's a good fashion statement, right? Oh, and wet hair again. <laughs> it is what it is. I don't know what to tell you. All right, that's it for right now. I'll be back. Hey guys, so it is Friday morning, 10:30 ish. We just. Um, my husband's working from home today and we just had the um, furnace cleaning people service. Um, AAA furnace and air conditioning actually to be exact. I'll link their website in the description below, below for those of you in Santa Clara County. Anyway, we had them out to clean the ducts in our house and you know check the system and make sure it didn't need any service or anything that everything was working properly, properly which it was. Guy was super nice. If you're gonna call them, ask for Gilbert. Really nice guy. Anyway, so he just left. So now I'm going to run to the grocery store again because I need a couple of things. And we have nothing for lunch. And so the husband is at home working and I'm gonna go run to the store and go get that done. I've also been chit-chatting and working on art business things with my creative conspirators. <laughs> uh, Cindy Utter, mostly this morning, but also uh, sending a few messages uh, in the Zoomers chat, which is a group of us artists who chat weekly in the Zoom app. It's a online conferencing app. For those of you who don't know, I will link again a link to their website where you can look into it more in the description below if you so choose. If you do any online conference calling or anything like that, I do recommend the app at the moment because it seems to be way more stable than most of your other apps that do the same thing. All right, so anyway, we're just waiting at this time. We had all the doors and everything open in the house while they were cleaning out the central air system, the heater, the furnace, uh, the heater, the air conditioner, the duct work. So I'm a little bit chilly, so I've got a sweatshirt on, but how much you want to bet by the time I get home, I'm hot. Yeah, I'm gonna have to take it off. It's probably a good bet. It's a safe bet. is finally saving. <laughs> I'm a day behind getting it edited and loaded and stuff. Yeah, so anyway, it's happening right now. I'm gonna go run and get the mail. And see what is over there. I don't expect a lot, but you know, I did order some things from Wish. So they take forever to come in. They just kind of trickle in when they do. So there might be one or two things. If you don't know what Wish is, it is a 
discount website. Uh, most of the most of the goods that are sold on the website are from China, I believe, and uh, I'll include a link to it in the description below. There's two big ones that everybody um, that are everybody shops at that are pretty popular. One is Wish, and the other one is AliExpress. There's loads and loads and loads of video on hauls from both websites. I would recommend before you go shopping at either website that you watch the videos. So I have this weird idea to do something with big sheets of like watercolored paper and I have these um, inks from Wish that were supposed to be like super metallic that aren't really but we're gonna use them up and I've got a spray bottle of water and two big pieces of old um, watercolor paper I almost said scrapbooking paper watercolor paper try to do this before it rains again I don't think it's going to the sky is blue but more importantly before the little demon devil dog comes over we do love her but oh my gosh my daughter's dog is crazy <laughs> all right so let's spray down our water and let's play with some minks let's see what happens a little muddier than intended but I like it and it's only the first layer all right I'm gonna let it dry and we'll be back I have like an hour before the demon puppy gets here 
Hopefully they can drip off a bit so I can move them out of harm's way. She might just eat them if I don't. We'll see what happens. So we're out on Saturday afternoon and we're out running errands because that's what we like to do in the look middle of the holiday season on look a Saturday, going, the busiest time. And look at the humanity. <laughs> so you saw me earlier at the computer listening to music, doing some work. Now we're out hopefully having fun. We'll see. I don't even think most of California gets cold enough to wear these socks. They're super soft though. Sunday morning sometime I don't exactly know what time it is but anyway um, uh, the husband is at the gym and I've been cleaning and purging and getting ready for the holiday season and I just finished this is the guest room by the way it has some of my artwork whoop there you go see you can see hanging up in it these down here those are pieces waiting to sell they're in my Etsy shop, so if you'd like a piece of artwork for your house, go look at the Etsy shop. It's all for sale. And if something that you've seen here in this video is not listed, let me know. The one in the black frame is done by a friend of mine. Isn't it fabulous? Um, he is. His name is Jim Campbell. He's a fabulous pen and ink artist. He's been on a few U.S. postage stamps. Like he's a yeah, he's kind of well known. Anyway, these are all mine. 
We spent yesterday cleaning out the guest room closet and putting, ooh, trying to show you here, things away. There's some gift wrap, spare coats. We were trying to get the games together for family game night. There you go. So we got a shelf to go in here, so we now have all kinds of games. And I've got, where is it? Way up there. Can you see it? Yeah, more artwork for sale. So if you need some art, if you need some artwork, I've got some artwork. <laughs> if you want to get some for a Christmas gift, go look at the Etsy shop. The originals are for sale. So anyway, that's what I've been up to today. And there's all the Christmas gift wrap is out ready. We're not expecting company um, until after Christmas. So I can just leave this out here and we can use this as like the gift wrapping room, um, which is ideal. Um, I forgot where I was going with that, but I got a bunch of business stuff done this morning and I have a video conference in a little while. So I'm gonna sit and just chill and get some water. And I now have an empty Ikea cart, the rolling three tier cart that had the gift wrap in it, but we're not putting it back in the closet and we're just keeping the one little box of gift wrap and the rest of this, what we don't use is being given away or, or gotten rid of at the end of the holiday season. I don't need to store gift wrap anymore. That's just ridiculous. Um, so now I have to figure out what I want to do with the Ikea cart. I really love it. So I really kind of don't want to get rid of it. So I'm going to find a purpose for it. I just don't know exactly yet what that purpose is going to be. Maybe something in the art room, but maybe not. I'm thinking about using it out in the front room. So we'll see. That's it for right now. I'll be back. How are you? So I just picked up all the mail at Postal Annex. Big giant pile of mail. You can't even see it all on the camera. Uh, I guess all the Christmas gifts I've been ordering started coming in. At least I hope that's what that is. <laughs> um, as you saw, my husband and I went out to lunch. We went to Five Guys. Love that place. And I just sent out the first um, of the packages to the design team. So woohoo, you guys are, some of you guys are, got your stuff that's on the way. I also had a couple of early morning meetings with Mike Deacon about the stencils, working on some things for that. And also chit chat with Robert Moon about um, the upcoming stamp sets. I've got some drawing to do. If I have any designs, I think want to be submitted to those sets. Otherwise, they have to wait. So I think I'm going to sit this afternoon and do some drawing, and we'll see where I, how far I get. That's it for right now. I'll be back. In case I forgot to say, it's Monday, November 20th. Yeah, because, you know, it's one of those days. <laughs> again buying pie for Thanksgiving dinner. Kind of bummed because they have not too many customer refreshment snacks. Nope. You know, customer appreciation refreshments. That's what they're for, right? That's what they're for. I thought so, but we didn't have too many. We didn't have too many. I was bummed. I, was I know. expecting more. So anyway, we've been to the doctors already. We've been to drop the car off for tires already. Now we're going to buy pie. Go grocery shopping. Head home. And head home. That's it for now. So we forgot to get the liquor yesterday for Thanksgiving. It is Wednesday, November 22nd, and we're at the store looking for wine. See, if it was me, I'd get this one because that's a cool label. <laughs> I like that one. I do too. I do mixed media, so yeah. you know, I want to like soak the yep. bottle and get the label off. I don't even drink, so that's kind of the funnier part. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, 
see, look at this one with all the elephants. No. I like the labels. The labels are cool. That one's kind of creepy cool. Can we get a silk soft blend? This one. Purple Paradise? I like the label. I don't care what the wine tastes like. I'm not going to drink it. Would be funny if I asked Maria if I could take a bunch of empty wine bottles home with me from Thanksgiving dinner. It wouldn't be funny at all. What's on the side here? These are the big bottles. These are the big giant bottles of cheap wine. Yeah, I just like the labels. They're cool. Let's maybe go. Somebody. Go ahead. There you go. What's YouTube gonna demonetize me? Seriously. Worry, They've already up. done that on some video. <laughs> Hey guys, that was our week this week. It is a holiday week. I'll be honest with you, I'm filming the week's ending instead of Wednesday evening. Uh, or afternoon. It's Friday morning. Um, it was Thanksgiving here in the United States and Thursday and Friday. Uh, as you saw, we spent some time at Costco and the, or at, I'm sorry, not Costco, at Lucky. We are at Costco a lot. Um, at the grocery store, uh, buying wine and liquor for the holiday, making sure we had the pie and everything else. And, um, you know, the, just the preparations for the holiday. I forgot to film anything. So that happens. But anyway, that was our week. It was a good one. Um, and uh, to see how our holiday went, I do have some, a little bit of footage for the next vlog. It's pretty funny. Um, there's one clip of all the kids, and I was going to take the sound out, but it actually was pretty funny. So I may leave the sound in. But anyway, you'll see it. Um, don't forget to have a great week, everybody. And uh, if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them in the comments below. And uh, that's it for right now. Check out the video description for any relevant links. And have a great day. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. And I'll see you later. Bye, guys. Bye.